Congratulations on the win. Just watching that game from up here, it looked like you went through just about every emotion possible in that 20 minutes or so. <laughs> it's just what I do all the time. I put myself through so so many difficult games when they don't need to be as difficult as that. I think uh, obviously the pace early doors was perfect, and then I think he slowed himself down, regrouped himself, which it's up to him to do. And I struggled with that pace, and uh, I was nearly asleep at the end of that game. So hey, it's it's a win. I'll I'll take it. Look, you were three one up. Oh, sorry, three, you were behind, then in front, and then there at the end. It's just one of those games that you just couldn't quite get to grips with. What's going through your mind going into that last leg? Just win the game. It doesn't matter what the score is. I put myself in a little position. I've just got to go out there and win, and hopefully the results go my way. And to to shoot out tomorrow between me and me and Johnny, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Having lost that opening game yesterday, were you more frustrated with the manner of performance rather than the defeat? I was uh, because I practiced so well uh, yesterday. I had done the same same tonight. Today I, I was practicing with Nathan Rafferty, and we both missed nothing. And uh, I had a nine daughter backstage with, with Raf, and he, the way he went up there and, and played, it was no surprise because he was doing it on the practice board. I was just disappointed that I, I, I wasn't doing exactly the same. But those things happen, and I, as long as I got the win, it puts myself in, in position, and I've got a chance. So. I suppose the, the murky waters is if Johnny wins, and then you against Johnny, and everyone can still get through. It's a, it's a complex situation these group games. It is. Johnny Johnny is one of my best mates. Um, obviously, we we spend a lot of time together. But I think in favour for me, Josh, to beat uh, Johnny, and then it's a it's a shootout, like I said. Um, but like I say, he's one of my best mates. It's hard to call, and you don't like to see him lose. But I'm a I'm a <laughs> Josh Rock, Josh Rock uh, fan. Later on. Look, we don't, you don't play these round robin groups anywhere else apart from here. Does this play havoc with the mind games and stuff like that? Because you don't know. Normally, you just win and you're in or yeah. you're out and things like that. So, coming into this does, this, does this play havoc? Yeah, well, they don't know what you need to do. Um, I, I don't look too much into it and bother about legs and that. But like I say, when people's filling you with stats and what you need to do, you just try and block that out and yeah, just let yeah let your darts do the talking. And I'm, I'm just pleased to give myself a, a little chance and. Uh, Hopefully things go right for me. You gonna watch the game? Nah, definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be straight back. Don't congratulations. Cheers, mate. Cheers. Cheers. You mentioned about the pace of the game there being obviously quite slow with the very stop start, but do you think that's a sign of how you've matured as a player that you're able to hold it together and still come through them? Yeah, of course. Obviously, everybody knows what he's been through in the past, so I can't take anything away from that. I can't be disrespectful, but um, obviously the pace early doors. It was lovely. They were they were going, and he just trying to get himself composed and that. Which, if he feels that he needs to do that, then then so be it. You know, obviously, like I said before, he's he's had been through a rough patch, and he's getting himself back to play some good darts, and it, it's nice to see. So I'm I'm just pleased to to come through that tough game for me. 2016, the last time you came through the group at the Grand Slam, how determined are you to to do that again and then Yeah, definitely. Um, obviously. It's a great tournament. It's it's good to be back, but it was m kind of my breakthrough tournament as well, reaching the quarterfinals on debut. So it'll be nice to to get back into to winning ways and hopefully go deep in the competition. Cheers, Chris. Cheers, man. Chris, you're coming to this tournament as the Masters champion. Does it feel just a little bit different entering the tournament when you are a champion rather than just getting through the qualifiers? Yeah, it, uh, it was actually nice to see me face on the on the uh, the poster, you know, and I was one of them that they've got a chance to win it but uh, no I, I, I've come in every competition exactly the same mentally prepared I, I practice right I do the same routine and yeah nothing changes in the practice routine other than when it does for the Grand Prix so yeah I'm, I'm just like I say happy to, to give myself a chance and hopefully tomorrow night will, will be my night It's been a real breakout year for you and you said that you've been practicing well You've not played how you can the past two games. Can you explain why that is? <clears throat> nah, not really. Um, everything, everybody goes through a bad patch, um, and I haven't had a bad patch for for some time now. And I've been playing great darts, so everybody's allowed a blip. And obviously, it's just not nice to have your blip on on the stage, on the TV stage. So I'll I'll bring myself through that, and I'll uh, I use a new set of darts tonight. Um, so yeah, they feel feel all right. So. I'll be using them again tomorrow. Why is it that you've, you've changed? Because we know that you've changed manufacturers, you've got a new set from Target, but you've, you've changed tonight. <coughs> What's the thinking behind that? It's just uh, grip, um, brand new brand new barrel, it's nice. Obviously, it's cold up there, or is it hot up there? They could, they could be sticking in your hands, and 
if you've wore the barrels in, the slip and the heat. So yeah, I just tried a new barrel. They've been going great in practice. And to be honest, it went all right up there. It's just nervy moments. Some stick their hand and some don't, but nah, it's nice to, nice to win. And you spoke about the, the permutations in the group today, but will you just focus on, on winning the match tomorrow and then what happens, happens? Yeah, that's it. Put myself into a position. Um, obviously, they can battle it out, and if I if I get through, I get through. It's, I'm not I'm not going to put any pressure on myself. Um, obviously, I was disappointed with the way I played the first time because I, I felt I had my chances. It just didn't happen. But um, yeah, I put myself in a position. I, I've won the game, and hopefully, the results go my way, and, and we can battle out tomorrow. We'll <laughs>